Joe and I had uh, a lot of time to prepare for this moment. Some of her uh, requests, uh, for instance, that I should bring Claudia Schiffer as my date to the funeral. I was confident she expected me to ignore. But others, she was pretty damn clear about. When she first mentioned what's about to happen, I said, over my dead body. And she said, no, Daniel, over mine. And uh, as usual, my darling girl and Sam's darling mom was right. So she's going to say her final farewell to you, not through me, but inevitably, ever so coolly, through the immortal genius of the Bay City Rulers. spends all the time in his room. I mean, he'll be up there now. There's nothing unusual about that. My horrid son... Bernard. Bernard stays in his room all the time. Thank goodness. Yeah, but, Karen, this is all the time. I'm afraid that there's something really wrong, you know? I mean, clearly it's about his mom, but... Christ, he, he might be injecting heroin into his eyeballs for all I know. The age of 11? Well, maybe not as eyeballs then. Maybe just the veins. So, what's the problem, Samuel? Is it just mum, or is it something else? Huh? Maybe school? Are you being bullied? Or is it something worse? Give me any clues, no? You really want to know? I really want to know? Even though you won't be able to do anything to help? Even if that's the case, yeah. OK. Well, the truth is, actually, I'm in love. Sorry? I know I should be thinking about Mum all the time, and I am. But the truth is, I'm in love. It was before she died, and there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> Aren't you young to be in love? No. Oh, oh okay. Well, oh. I mean, I'm a little relieved. Why? But because I thought it would be something worse. Worse than the total agony of being in love? Uh, no, you're right. Total agony. Hey, Samo. Can't sleep. I got some terrible news today. Let's have it. Joanna's going back to America. Your girl's American? Yes, yeah, she's American. But she's not my girl. And she's going back to America. That's the end of my life as I know it. That is bad news. Well, we need Kate. And we need Leo. And we need them now. Come on. Well, you know, Sammy, I'm sure she's unique and extraordinary, but... General wisdom is that in the end, there isn't just one person for each of us. It was for Kate and Leah. There was for you. And there is for me. She's the one. Fair enough. Plan. Thank the Lord. Tell me. Well, girls love musicians, don't they? Uh huh. Even the really weird ones get girlfriends. That's right. Meatloaf definitely got laid at least once. For God's sake, Ringo Starr married a Bond girl. Whatever. There's this big concert at the end of term, and Joanna's in it. 
And I thought maybe if I was in the band and played absolutely superbly, there's a chance that she might actually fall in love with me. What do you think? I think it's brilliant. I think it's stellar. A apart from the one obvious tiny little baby little hiccup. But I don't play musical instrument. Yes, sir. A tiny insignificant detail. <laughs> Nothing to lose, and you'll always regret it if you don't. I never told your mom enough. I should have told her every day because she was perfect every day. You've seen the films, kiddo. It ain't over till it's over. Okay, Dad. Let's do it. Let's go get the shit kicked out of us by love. Yes. Wait, wait. We're not actually flying. You can't come through without a boarding pass. Not even to let the boy say goodbye to the love of his life. No. Jesus. Here, I've got to run. <laughs> 